Hi everybody, today is the poster 591, we are August 13, and I'm sorry, I forget to push the, the right audio button to record my voice, so I was talking 30 minutes for nothing, and uh, I, it's probably good, because the only things I said was something about the the uh, rule of uh, third, which is the separation into the canvas between the middle. You select the middle of the middle, you put a grid there and on the other side too, you do the same uh, on horizontally. Uh, it's a very approximative there and uh, you get uh, four point and uh, on these four point points, there are the focal uh, points that you should put your elements on uh, its uh, basic uh, photographic uh, skills to compose uh, a photography and to compose almost uh, everything you can print or see on the web. And uh, that's something I use uh, relatively every day to make, uh, to create my posters. So uh, I think it's uh, it's interesting to know that and to, to dig deeper if you are not familiar with that. And it, uh, in, if that interests you, uh, you should uh, you should search more information about, uh, about this uh, rule of third. Because it is important if you want to create something who looks uh, relatively good. So now that you can hear me, uh, I did like yesterday, almost, uh, select uh, the brain, uh, put levels on two times and uh, apply uh, filter, other, eye pass and set the eye pass layers under the U blending mode. I also create a shadow there. The shadow is made of the brain that I uh, turn by hit command T and uh, modify his uh, shapes. I also, I also sh set uh, the layer under multiply blending uh, mode. And uh, yeah, I select the colors of the brain to set a nice background uh, with this uh, mint green and this uh, purple color there. Um, yeah, I use the side view of the brain because it can change the it change the dynamic of the poster and uh, and how you read it um, so that's almost everything i say uh, earlier so you didn't miss a lot of stuff now come the interesting part of the process because I simply don't know what to do. No ID for for the next part. So I merge those layer together to be sure uh, that I can uh, use them back in case if I need. I copy them. Um, yeah, the poster is a uh, very Aerial now. Uh, it looks uh, pretty minimalist, and um, yeah, it's uh, it's a good thing. I think I should stay minimalist, but I have to add uh, to add something more to the poster because something is missing and. Uh, you, click, you can clearly see that it's not enough to present a poster that way. Uh, 
I want to change the opacity to zero and uh, make a square there or a rectangle. Oh. Pasty under zero. Yeah. That way is better. Let's modify. Oh, no, 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 no. Like this. Change the blending mode. Oh, dissolve it looks very strange. Lighten no, 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 no. I think the pin pin light or something there looks good. Soft light, yeah, soft light. Soft light looks very, very, very sweet. Place this rectangle in the center of the canvas there. Okay, pin light is a better option. Uh, yeah, maybe white was not a good idea. Let's select um, another color, not you. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Let's select the same color there. Okay. Fine. Um. Duplicate the shape and change it to another color. Maybe the pink there looks uh, looks good. Let's see how it looks like. Yeah, it's fine. And for the transparent color too. Up. Select one more time, duplicate. Touch the A letter on the keyboard and continue the process there with the purple. Done. Select the three shape. Not on the canvas, but add into the selection. I distribute the space equally between them and I duplicate. Oh.
select them all and align them equally command D I will enlarge them a little bit here we are okay I put them in a folder and place all of this layer in the center maybe the loop too small and I have to what if I go above the canvas let's see what happens hmm looks weird like a brain rainbow It's too high. Let's go here for. Mm, looks better now. And what if I duplicate those layer? Put them there. But put them in the front of the brain. No. Ah, not bad, huh? Of course, I can search more effect. But I think it's enough for today, and uh, I thank you to follow me along uh, with this short poster tutorial. I hope uh, you learn a little bit something about the process or uh, little uh, skills I used. And uh, yeah, feel free to use uh, Photoshop. If you don't feel free, uh, you can always save your poster or your design under another name and try uh, try something new and go back to the older uh, file to go back or push uh, Command Z to come back. And uh, yeah, everything is uh, in your mind everything that it is in your mind and you want to put it, put it on the canvas you you can do it uh, you can do it really if you have a good idea just work on it have a nice day i thank you again for the support and the, the view i see you tomorrow for the poster 592 see you have a nice day goodbye